In less than 22 hours, the Carnival cruise ship Triumph is going to set sail from the port of Galveston, the first cruise for the vessel since it stranded some 4,000 people at sea four months ago. Local 2 consumer expert Amy Davis is live in Galveston right now with the ship's return and what it means to business on the island. Amy? Well, yeah, Bill, me and this cruise ship go way back. It was February when I spent about five days in Mobile, Alabama, waiting for a tow ship to tow this, this ship back to port there when it lost power in the Gulf of Mexico. It can hold about 3,000 passengers, another 1,000 crew members, and those were all tourists that restaurants and businesses here in Galveston have missed since Carnival canceled all cruises here in mid-February from the Triumph. We can tell you that all of those folks are anxious to hear that Carnival horn come Four o'clock tomorrow. The images from Triumph's last voyage are hard to shake. Passengers sprawled out on the deck with a desperate message for helicopters overhead. They camped out in tents and called in reports of the awful conditions when they could get a cell signal. Pipes are busting. I know the sewer is backing up and like water is in the cabins, and it's just a nightmare. But Carnival posted this YouTube video of what it hopes will be the ship's new image after $115 million of upgrades and repairs. I think probably now it's the, probably the safest ship you can get on because they've probably done everything they need to do. From the strand to the seawall, business owners hope the ship brings back the tourists and their money. Those customers are going to be showing up in the early morning tomorrow. Uh, we'll see what kind of impact their arrival has on business tomorrow. We are sold out. Carnival crew members and passengers are already filling rooms at local hotels. And it's not just private businesses that have been hurting. We can tell you that the Port of Galveston had to revise its budget because it lost some $700,000 in port fees from the Triumph's 27 canceled cruises here. We're live in Galveston. I'm Amy Davis, KPRC, Local 2.